Hey guys, my name's Owen and I'm a first year medical student studying at Monash University, Australia. Today you'll be joining me as I take you through a typical Friday in the life of a uni student. I'm just about to go for a run, but then I'll head to class, so I guess I'll see you soon. All right, so we're pretty much ready to go. I'm wearing my Monash Student Association hoodie because it's getting a bit cold. Hashtag not sponsored. And uh, in my bag, I've got water bottle, bit of snacks for the day, pencil case, and in here, my iPad. And yeah, that's about it, so let's head off. All right, so Friday basically consists of two classes, an ICL or integrated case learning class in the morning and a consolidation workshop in the afternoon. The ICL is actually a lot of fun because you get to research your own topics out of the things you've learned in the week and then present it to a class as a fun little presentation. Hey, Angus, uh, what are your thoughts on a Friday? Friday Friday's not bad. It's a bit of an early start. We're here at nine o'clock. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know. I like it. It's got the motivation of the weekend coming up, so it, it turns out all right, I think. Okay, awesome. Thanks, Angus. No worries. See you soon. See so this week specifically, we're looking at breast cancer and the epidemiology behind it. And in particular, we're looking at the BRCA1 tumor suppressor gene and how it affects the body. We're at the um, ICL. I'm making a Kahoot. Uh, this is Alyssa. What do you think of Hello. ICLs, Alyssa? Um, ICL is my favorite class. I particularly love how it's at 9 a.m. on a Friday. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Ishan Gol for attending every 9 a.m. ICL Friday. Always on time. <laughs> okay, Selene's done. Hey, Selene, what do you think of ICLs? <laughs> yeah, I think, I think it's great. I have a question for you. What's my name? Um, it's it's Selene. <laughs> okay, I got it right. I got it right. Salami. Salami. <laughs> um, Jackie, what do you think of ICLs? It's great. It's great. <laughs> okay. So as you can see, ICLs are generally quite fun, but they do often fly by quickly. So after our presentation was over in the morning, I decided to head over to the South One Lawn to go collect my long-awaited Monash Medicine merchandise. <laughs> Nelson, hey. you got your two hoodies, bro. Yeah, I got two. How do you feel? I feel good. I feel good. <laughs> How are you feeling today, Ian? Great, absolutely fantastic. Okay, are you ready to pick up your hoodie? I am. I've been waiting so long for this. Yeah, me too, me too. So let's open it up. All right, here it is. Looking pretty nice, actually. Um, let's pop it on. Pretty good fit, I reckon. Looks pretty nice, I think. And after my hoodie collecting shenanigans, I decided to hit the gym quickly before my next class. So I prepped myself a bit of creatine, protein, and chucked it all in my bag, ready to go.
Look at that booty. So after that brief gym session, it was time to head back and make some lunch. Inside the Richardson Hall kitchen, just about to heat up some food here. So here we oh, have uh, Michael. Michael, how are you feeling about the workshop tonight? Feeling excited, yeah. um, alive, ready for the week to be over. Yeah. And then looking forward for the weekend. Awesome. Thanks, Michael. All right, I need the um, post post workshop. Post workshop. That was a good workshop. I actually enjoyed. Good that. workshop. Yeah. yeah it was good oh, sick. Everything. Awesome. Yeah. All right. Thanks, boys. All right. So thankfully, the workshop did finish 30 minutes early, so I was able to get back and do my washing. As it turns out, when you live away from home, your mummy sadly won't clean your clothes for you anymore. But anyway, after that. I decided it would probably be good to do some study so I went back to my room for 30 minutes to catch up on some content and do some video editing before the Richardson Hall trivia night. There are prizes for the winners. Hall cap badges or five Hall cap badges for the winning team. <laughs> Alright, we ready to go team? Yeah. Ready? Sweaty baby! The first category we have is science. Yeah, it's weird. easy. What does DNA mean? How do we go? We did really well in the academic rounds, but the like culture, culture let us down. So with the Richardson Hall trivia night finishing up at a solid second place, I decided it was time to make a quick snack because I was feeling a little peckish and could probably do with some meal prep for the upcoming week. Righty, comments on tonight's dinner? Look, it's a lot. Uh, well, I like I like the chicken. Chicken. Um, bit of salmon, bit of garlic bread. Yeah. I think um, it'll last you a lot of a lot of time. It's good to meal prep yeah. a lot of stuff. So you don't have to cook very often, yeah. Definitely Thank solid advice. Probably. Solid oh, advice. All right, yeah, thanks, boys. And while I was at it with my meal prepping, I also managed to score a bit of free food from our on-site master chef who was dishing out some awesome food for us all. What do we think, boys? Man, it smells good. It smells good. I'm fucking ready to chef it up. I'm ready to chef it up. And at 10pm after my dinner, the boys took me for a late night drive to do some shopping and I was pleased to say that I was offered the most luxurious ride in a V8 Turbo Hyundai which boasted some of the latest safety features and modern technology. Yeah, give us the horn. <laughs> give us the horn. The horn for the vlog, surely. <laughs> 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 oh, it's too good. And when I got back home, I quickly FaceTimed one of my mates because I often don't get a chance to talk to him very much anymore. I have a quick chat uh, with my friend Rakdo from Cairns. He's studying at JCU Med um, in Townsville. And with that quick little chat done and dusted, I thought it might be nice to play my cello for a bit and make sure I'm on top of my skills. <laughs> Alrighty, so now I'm just chilling in the common room at my hall. Um, not every day is like this, it's not as action-packed all the time, uh, but it is definitely a lot of fun and I hope you guys uh, can get involved in your uni life. Um, here's Ricardo, what do you think of your day? It was good, it was good. Um, the assignments are rolling in, so we've just got to be a bit more organised. Um, yeah. No time, just get everything done. Um, don't leave it till the last minute, stuff like that. Um, yeah, definitely. But the content is all very interesting. Yeah. Tru like truly, it's good content. Yeah, so. At 11 o'clock, I decided it was probably best to start heading to bed. So I commenced my nightly routine of brushing my teeth, doing a bit of flossing, and then applying my skincare routine, all as a part of my commitment to becoming a healthier and happier individual. So in the last 30 minutes of my day, I usually end up watching a little bit of YouTube, followed by some leisurely reading as I wind down and prepare to end the day. So in summary, my productive day in the life starts off in the morning with my usual routine and a run if I can, followed up with some breakfast and heading off to class if necessary or studying, then hitting the gym. In the afternoon, I like to have a bit of lunch, catch up with some friends, do a bit of cello practice, finish up with some study and then dinner and of course sleep. If you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. As you can see, medicine isn't all doom and gloom. There's lots of fun to have in between tutorials and workshops and study sessions. If you want to see what my first week was like as a medical student, check out that video over there. But in the meantime, do remember to like, subscribe and hit that bell icon and I'll see you in the very next video. Peace.